Greetings, Elder Black Light. As we approach the beginning of a new year, I want you to pay close attention to what I'm talking about, what I'm about to say, and especially the teachings of Master Farad Muhammad through his servant and messenger, the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. The name of this video, The Judgment Is Now. This video will prove that Master Farad Muhammad is the God that Elijah was talking about that will come after him. One more thing I want to say to the brothers, Muslim brothers, and through the Moors, and also the brothers of God, the nation of gods on earth, and Hebrew Israelites, and black Christians alike. This time of separation. You got to separate the weeds from the flowers. I put it like that. Some weeds look like flowers, but are not. Some brothers look like brothers, but are not. Same goes with the sisters. Now, the Nation of Islam trying to buy buildings to get a mosque, to have a mosque. But you, you gotta pay the light bill and electric bill. And you know, rent, taxes on the place. You're giving it right back to the slave master. So why not hold meetings in the basement? Why not put your school in the basement? Why not uh, everyone shop together wholesale? You know, well, I can't see why the, the Moors and the... Uh, we'll talk about that on another day. But pay attention to this, uh, this video. I know that you still hands. Until today, you will have to go and dig. Dig and dig. To find the marks of their civilization. They are there. According to the Holy Quran and according to our own scientists today who have went and dug and dug, digged up the earth and made it clear that they found buildings down under their sands, brought them to light. Some of them is unearthing themselves. The wicked white race have been continuous to do evil and lead the black man into filth and evil. They are today, while they are in judgment, they are trying their utmost night and day, every hour, 24 hours, to get you to yield evil and filth. Some of them here and there is against it. They're not speaking out against the evil done of themselves. But they are absolutely made of evil. They are not people that have some good in them and evil. 
have too many. No, it was not made with good as Jesus tell and teaches you and me. And John the eighth and forty fourth. They was created a liar and a murderer. The lie could only stand so long as the light of truth did not make its appearance. But in this dreadful day, there can be no judgment unless truth is told. I will let the Jesus describe this day and time in his parable of a soul who went out and sold his field with good seeds. But while he slept at night an evil enemy came and sold terrors among his Next morning, the day of judgment, the nearing of judgment, the discovery of what the enemy has done to the people, sown in the hearts of the righteous evil, and now they are practicing evil and must be judged according to their works. A dreadful day. Four great judgments is now working on America. Storm, wind, rain, hail, snow. How much of this is yet to come until that you are totally I'll snow upon your country from the north. As your Bible teaches you and Job, he have saved this snow and ice for the day of battle and war. It's going on. There is plenty of snow in the north, plenty of ice in the north to be hurled down upon poor America who has no defense against such calamity. At the same time, in the tropical regions, rising up and brewing storms in the Caribbean area, some say Caribbean, moving them northward and Northwest to strike the shores of America, destroy her home, destroy the lives of her cattle, destroy her people. Let's pause it. This one goes out to all the brothers, so called brothers, the Hakka Bay, Zainetta, Tariq Nasheed. to name a few, on Black Light, spreading the truth, passing the mic. Truth should be told and not sold, to be continued. 